Hello, right, we're going to talk about uh, dealing with multiple roundabouts. Um, quite often in any town or city you get a roundabout and another roundabout and that can cause problems. So this video is going to show you how to deal with that. A couple of things just to mention, don't speed up after the first one. <laughs> and number two, um, it's okay to go the wrong way. So if you end up, for example, in the right lane and you're supposed to be going left, check your mirrors. As long as you've got a signal on, you can go around that roundabout as many times as you like. Check out my online driving course. There's a full video, really detailed on how to approach roundabouts on there. Um, link is in the description below uh, and it is www.ultimatedriving.net and you will find on there at least four hours of footage, 18 different videos and all of them have got multiple choice, detailed questions with really detailed explanations after each vid. So let's get stuck in. Okay, so we're going to start with going straight ahead at this roundabout and then right at the second. So because I know I'm going right at the second, I'm going to check my main and right mirror, keep to the white line and aim for the right lane. I'm not signalling right because that would be confusing to anyone behind, uh, just making sure it's safe. It is safe on the right, but I'm not going to rush this because it's tricky. I've got to check my centre and left mirror signal. I'm going to have a little blind spot check there. I'm going to aim for this bollard on the right because that is the right lane, there are three lanes. Then I mirrors and signal right, once the nose of my car's in there. Okay, and then looking on the right, it's clear, and I can go. I keep to the right, stay in the right lane, count the exits, we want the third one, so I get to the middle of the second one, which is there, left mirror, little check, signal, and keep checking that left mirror once, and there we have it, exited the roundabout. The advantage of doing what we did is if at the first one, there was someone on my left side when I went straight ahead, I've got the option to do a U-turn and go back round if I stick a right signal on at the first roundabout. So if at any point you feel you can't make it, you've always got that option to stick a right signal on, just do a U-turn and come back again. Otherwise you end up being stuffed and you can't actually do what you want to do today. Okay, so we're now going to be going left at the first roundabout, first exit and straight ahead, second exit. So I've got a queue of traffic in front, checking my centre mirror, reducing that speed. I don't want to join that queue of traffic if I can avoid it. Uh, it's bad for sort of fuel economy, in this case my battery, I have to use more energy in order to get moving again. So just by keeping moving, I'm going to do that. Right, I'm close to the roundabout now, so I'm going to check mirrors and signal left because I'm going left. Remember, I'm going to turn left into the lane I want, but because I'm going straight ahead at a normal roundabout next, I would choose the left lane, okay? So as soon as my nose is into the left lane of the second roundabout, I need to cancel that signal now, otherwise you might leave it on and go straight ahead with the left signal, which would mean that the exit on the left, a vehicle might pull out of and hit me now, thinking I was turning left. So that one was quite straightforward. Okay, so we've got another couple of roundabouts coming up. I'm going to be turning left at the first one and right at the second one. So we're turning left into the right lane. On top of that, I've got some things to think about here. There's several junctions on approach to this left turn. Need to be careful with the signal. So I'm just going to check my mirrors. I'm going to get my hand ready and I can't signal to after this. I've already got my speed down. I know what's behind me. Now signal, it's safe and I'm aiming for the bollard so I aim directly for that right lane. Then check my mirrors, signal right, because I'm now in that right lane, and then I can enter the roundabout. And again, it's nice and safe, keep checking. Always check multiple times, people. And I'm gonna exit the roundabout. I need to be careful here. Um, I'm gonna mirrors and signal. There's two lanes as I exit here, so because of the queue there, it's actually safe for me to do that. Um, so I'm gonna just make a point of saying that if that left lane was free, I should have exited into it. And now I'm going to make every effort to move back to the normal driving position as soon as possible. So if that lorry wasn't there, I would have exited into the left lane. But because I knew the road and I knew there was an opportunity to exit into that right lane, I could have done that. If I didn't know the road, then I could have always gone round the roundabout again and bought some time and then moved off behind the lorry. So don't be afraid of going round the roundabout. If you miss your lane, miss your exit, as long as you're in the right hand lane when you're doing it. Okay, so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna turn left at the first roundabout, first exit, and then at the second roundabout, turning right, third exit. So at the second roundabout, I need the right hand lane. So I'm gonna check my mirrors, I'm gonna signal left. I'm looking out for these pedestrians and just reducing the speed gradually. 
they haven't pressed the button yet and I'm getting an early peek behind the van of what's there because I know that the van and the van <laughs> they're on the trailer I now can't see anything so I'm not going to trust that it's now safe because I've literally got no view okay great and then I aim for that bollard because I want the right hand lane now once my nose is in it check mirror signal right again keep the speed down don't accelerate between those two roundabouts most common thing I see there when I'm teaching is the pupil accelerates as they exit the roundabout and that might be something you do if there's nothing in front of you but if you've got a crossing another roundabout a traffic light don't accelerate towards it just think about what's in front of you okay so we're going to follow the road ahead at the first roundabout and turn right third exit the second one there's three lanes here so i'm opting to use the middle lane it's clearly marked what i need to do if you use the middle lane, you need to keep to the left on the roundabout, which makes the next bit a bit confusing. Just gonna let the, get the van go first, because I couldn't see briefly. Uh, check my mirror signal left. Now, because I want the right lane, I need to just check my blind spot. That's clear, and I'm aiming for that bollard again. Once my nose is there, check mirrors and signal right, and then we take third exit. Waiting for the lorry on the right. I've got a couple more cars, and I am good to go. So then I just go round, counting the exits. That's the first one, I want the third one. So now, check the left mirror, signal left, there's a blue car, just a little check in the blind spot in case there's a bike or anything else there, and we come off. Okay, so finally, we're going to be turning right at the first roundabout, third exit, and right again, third exit of the second one. So, there's a roundabout sign in the distance now, so I'm gonna check my center and right mirror, signal right to change into the right lane, keep an eye on the mirror, a little sideways glance, and just float across, canceling the signal. Remember, one signal shouldn't do two jobs. And you should check your mirrors again. So check main and right mirror, center right, signal right, reducing that speed. There's a queue in front of me, so I'm trying again not to have to stop at this roundabout because I don't want to stop. I'm starting to scan already to the right. That looks clear, looks clear looks clear and I want the right lane now I want the third exit on this one and then the third exit again so I need the right lane at the next one so I'm going to check my left mirror signal little blind spot check that's safe but aim for that bollard again and then once my nose is there mirrors signal right and then we're looking to the right it's safe carry on to the roundabout count the exits here we go coming up to the second one left mirror signal little blind spot check all safe and just aim for the curb on the left there isn't a bollard there but um, really clear um, edge of the road. And you just want to aim for the normal driving position most of the time, unless you know where you're going, or you know you're turning right, in which case you either want the right or a different lane according to the lane markings, if they were marked. So there we have it. Hope that's been helpful. Check out my other videos, and don't forget the online driving course.